Colorado is committed to the goal of every student reading at grade level by third grade. Statewide progress in recent years has benefited from the sustained vision, leadership, and collaboration of its foundation community with elected officials and educators. Colorado and Denver have made great strides toward the goal of third grade level reading by combining policy with ambitious program development and most importantly, alignment among elected officials, state and local agencies, school districts, nonprofits, visionary foundation leaders working together. This is how it's done. Colorado's vision for young children is expressed in the Early Childhood Colorado Framework, initially created in 2008 and redesigned in 2015 to better reflect today's priorities. Creating a shared vision and pathways for collaboration is key to building early childhood systems and ultimately a Colorado where all children are valued, healthy and thriving. So the framework grew out of 20 years work and when I was Lieutenant Governor, I realized that we had a chance in my office to really show people where there was a lot of work being done for kids, where there was a gap, nothing being done, and to pull the groups together who could figure out how to be comprehensive in the kind of communities and state we create for children. This vision is shepherded by the Early Childhood Leadership Commission. The role of the ECLC is to be a statewide leader, subject matter expert, and champion of best and promising practices throughout the state. The ECLC has been on the forefront of coordinated action in the areas of mental health, communications, and advancement of quality and access in early care and education. It is an advisory council that is comprised of 20 people from a whole variety of sectors. We do have business leaders who are invested in making sure that all children have the supports and the services that they need to be able to read when they get to school and, and are reading at grade level by the time they get to third grade. Under Governor Hickenlooper's leadership, the Colorado Reading to Ensure Academic Development Act, Colorado Read Act, was passed during the 2012 legislative session. The goals, identify struggling readers as early as possible, take action with interventions, and share accountability for reading outcomes with teachers, administrators, parents, and students. Since its passage, the rates of children identified as having a significant reading deficiency have decreased every year. The READ Act was in response to starting to see that the test scores of Colorado kids are in reading, especially the foundational reading skills between preschool and third grade, were not where they needed to be, and that it made success in school as kids move through harder and harder. So a number of legislators and advocacy groups decided to set standards for early reading and to require that districts respond with tutoring, summer academies, a whole array of activities to boost reading. The governor also established the Office of Early Childhood in the Colorado Department of Human Services to provide more coordinated and impactful services for children and families. The Office of Early Childhood has achieved great gains, increasing the quality of early care and learning for children most at risk and providing additional supports for parents in their roles as the first and most important teacher. We had a tradition of early childhood issues being handled either in the governor or lieutenant governor's office. And we got to a point where that just didn't seem sustainable. So creating an office that was in state government seemed like the next step forward in pushing early childhood as a legitimate area for policymakers to address. Locally, Denver is incubating key grade level reading strategies in different ways. The Denver Preschool Program, Countdown to Kindergarten, Denver Plan 2020's Early Literacy Plan, and the Birth to Eight Roadmap. The Denver Preschool Program helps make preschool possible for all Denver families, regardless of income, through tuition support and access to information. Denver has one of the highest enrollment rates in the nation for city pre-K programs, third in the nation. In addition to a focus on access for all Denver's four-year-olds, DPP works to improve preschool quality, studies how preschool affects kindergarten readiness, and is a national advocate for excellence in early childhood education. The preschool program helps us to provide resources to every family in Denver uh, to give them access to quality, 
preschool program and make sure kids are ready to hit kindergarten. Denver Preschool Program has really played a key role um, in improving quality across our system. The key is, is yes, we want access, but we want children to have quality experiences. Denver wants all families, both parents and children, to feel welcome when they walk through a school's kindergarten door. Countdown to Kindergarten, led by the Office of Children's Affairs under Denver Mayor Michael Hancock, is a community-wide effort established to better inform parents of preschool-aged kids on school readiness and the importance of their role in the academic achievement of their children in kindergarten and beyond. In its initial stages, more than 420 families have participated in early literacy training sessions, resource fairs, and school choice workshops. It's very important for us that we're putting countdown to kindergarten programs in neighborhoods that have what we call limited opportunity. And so we focus our efforts in those neighborhoods where we know that kids need greater supports. At roughly the same time, Denver Public Schools built and launched the Early Literacy Plan as a part of the Denver Plan 2020. With ambitious goals for dramatically improving grade level reading, it focused the district's attention on the assessments, interventions, parent engagement, and resources required to achieve that improvement. The Denver 2020 plan focuses more on early literacy because Denver Public Schools understood the importance of reading by third grade proficiently. And so students being able to learn to read by third grade and reading to learn after third grade is critical. In 2016, the City of Denver, Denver Public Schools, and numerous early childhood community partners came together to launch the Denver Birth to Eight Roadmap. Building off the Early Childhood Colorado Framework, the roadmap brings together Denver Public Schools, the mayor's office, and community stakeholders in a mission to support and empower families living in neighborhoods of concentrated poverty so that their young children reach their developmental potential and succeed in school and in life, starting with early language and literacy. The roadmap in our various roles really allowed us to simply say, DPS, you take care of what's on inside of that school door. The city of Denver's job is to take care of what's on the other side of that school door. DPS is making very intentional efforts to improve growth in reading scores in their classrooms where children are still reading behind grade level. Um, and that's their specialty, and we rely on them to do that. We really recognize the city role looks different. And so what are those services and supports that we do and that we bring to the table to help move this really large, ambitious goal? The progress we've made in Colorado is really because of individuals and advocacy organizations. Now we're at a point where we can get very large systems to work together so that parents and children experience early childhood and early reading as a smooth continuum. Those young people who are in the early childhood edu education classrooms and in kindergarten that's our future. Those young people, they're the next mayor, the next governor, the next business tycoon, uh, the next nurse doctor are sitting in those classrooms and we have a responsibility to make sure we prepare them.